Oh, we've got about a dozen dime novels here. Um, most of them are uh, Buffalo Bill Weekly, but the first couple are, uh, well, start with it's a young athlete weekly. Number 17, 1905. Nice, nice baseball cover. Does have some age spotting along the edge. Edges. Tape on the spine on the back. The spine itself is good condition. I guess they just put it as reinforcement on the staples. Better show on the front. These are going to be listed on our eBay site as well as our website, Dime Novel Hunter. If you want to go to uh, the website, best thing to do is put www.dimenovelhunter.com in a browser and it'll pull it up. If you go searching for Dime Novel Hunter, you're going to end up at our website for YouTube, World Level Videos, or Dime Novel Hunter, the eBay site. So uh, we do offer free shipping from the website. If you have any questions, you can email me at dimenovelhunter at gmail.com. We have a James Boy Weekly, number 8, 1901, D.W. Stevens. This piece missing on the back. Split here. Two right there. Very sought after Buffalo Bill Weekly. Number what is it, 124? 124, 1915, devil cover. Spine is split. Uncut? No, just white pages. I said the spine is split. Fold over down here. Both front and back are there, however. Buffalo Bill Stories 511. Connie Bill and the King of the Boom Land Boomers. 1911. Buffalo Bill Stories number 365. Piece missing down here. Spine is split down to the bottom. Still attached here and there. <laughs> okay, didn't see this in here originally. Buffalo Bill Classic Illustrated Comic 106. Pencil mark on. 398 Buffalo Bill stories. Buffalo Bill's Dutch Pard. Must have uh, training out what outweighs long service. So basically you're saying is it doesn't matter how long you work for somebody, if you're not trained up to date, you're liable to lose your job. That wouldn't be nice to know in 1911. 1906 actually. Uh, let's see, Buffalo Bill 346, 1907. It's got some chipping along the edge there. We're running most of the stuff through eBay at this point and then moving over to our website. Our website's got probably six or seven thousand issues at this point. Got some chipping in through there. Number 381. Got some tape on the spine. 383 has some pieces of tape on the spine as well. Buffalo Bill Weekly number 9. 
Honey Bill and the World Wind Ride. Got a piece missing here, a piece missing there, a couple of pieces missing along the edges. Claim the fame on this is that it's number nine. Pages are white, eh, cream. These are going to be listed, as I said, on our website, Guy and Marble Hunter. Have a good day.